Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and my holiday card series. So it was requested that I make a Hanukkah card, so that's exactly what we're gonna do today. So I've got my folded watercolor paper and I'm just gonna take some washi tape and create a triangle shape. I want all of the edges to be about the same length. They should be as close to the same length as possible. And then I'm taking my number 12 brush with clear water and filling that entire triangle. Now I'm taking some indigo blue mixed with, I think it's ultramarine blue that I mix this with, and I'm just kind of adding that onto the wet paper, then I'm adding mauve and then lamp black. I'll be using a tissue in this tutorial to lift off some of the color and to make some areas lighter and have some of the paper shine through a little bit. And then I'm taking my hair dryer and just speeding up the drying process a little bit and also dabbing some of those more puddled up areas with my tissue as I go. You can also let this dry naturally for video's sake, I'm just using the hair dryer. And then I'm taking the tape off and rotating it to create a triangle in the opposite direction. And you'll want to try to keep the very tips of that first triangle the same size on each corner, peeking out of the tape, if that makes sense. Um, and then I'm just filling in the new triangle the exact same way that I did previously. Again, using my tissue to dab off some of those more concentrated or wet areas of paint. And I'm gonna lift off a little bit more just to create a little bit of light effect, um, maybe like a cloudy kind of starry effect in the sky. So I'm drying this once again with the hair dryer and then peeling the tape off. And now we're gonna add some stars to this kind of galaxy starry night looking sky. So I've taken a brush with stiffer bristles and I've taken a white gouache. You can also just use a acrylic white paint, something that's more, um, th that's a bit thicker than watercolor paint and just put a little bit of water in there and splatter it using the brush and your fingers. Now using a white gel pen and a piece of scrap paper that I have here, I'm just creating these sort of larger star shapes in the sky. And then I'm going to use the same pen and just create larger dots in the sky as well just kind of emphasizing some of those splattered white dots. Now we're gonna add some menorah type candles to the top of this star. So I wanted the very tops to all be crisp and the same length, so I decided to put a piece of tape along the top. And then I'm just creating indigo colored um, rectangles from the top of the tape to the star. So you want four on each side here. And when that's finished, just peel the tape off and then we're gonna add the flames to the candles. And I'm gonna use the very tip of that top triangle as one of the, the final candle. And once again, I'm using that super gorgeous gold watercolor paint, which I will link below. I used it in the last tutorial, but as I explained there, I love it so much and it worked perfectly for these little flames. So that's pretty much all there is to it. Let it dry and you've got yourself a nice, unique, totally creative Hanukkah card. <laughs> So I hope that you guys liked this tutorial. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Share it with a friend if you want to. It really does help me out. So I hope to see you in the next one.